Hey everyone, so this is my first plushy huge transformation. So if you guys know, when I get plushies at garage sales and flea markets, and they need a little renewing to their fur, I just brush them with a dog brush. A wired dog brush. But when I say full transformation, for one, this guy needs washed. So we're going to wash him. Of course, he needs brushed out. He needs added stuffing. You could see how floppy he is. And nothing's wrong with floppy, but this is like, there's no stuffing at all right here. So like, yeah, added stuffing, brushed, and has a hole in his tail, which I'm probably gonna end up putting stuffing in his tail. But this guy, the tag is like off, like worn off. So do you guys know what company this guy could be from? Could he be from Animal Alley or e j Classics or some other company? I don't know, but I love this guy so much. And I'm glad I got him, even though he's raggedy. I'm going to record his transformation. So first, we're going to give him a bath. Fearless! <laughs> He's going to go in a pillowcase in the washer, so I'll see you after he's out of the bath. Okay, so look how disgusting this is. This is I'm replacing it. This is disgusting. Yeah, must stuffing. That's the type of... That's the type of stuff from plushy mar marketing ripoff. <laughs> no, that's good. Mm. I'll just replace it all. Mm. This, this blank ring's a little lops lopsided. Uh, oh, yeah, it keeps falling apart. I'm just gonna have to sweep afterwards. Okay, I think we're good with recording for now. Uh-oh, there's beans. There's beans on his leg. I don't want to take that out. <laughs> okay. What's blocking the fur from coming out of the nest? Look how floppy this thing is because I was stuffing it up. <laughs> yeah. But relax, there's it's going to be new stuffing inside. Yeah, he's getting fresh stuffing. Because the stuffing was dirty. <laughs> this is funny though, isn't it? What is blocking this from coming out? There's huh. like strings in there. Hmm. Why is there strings in his face? Yeah, this is like the full Star Wars scene all over again. Do you know what he means by that? I think most of them do. <laughs> this is just fun, actually. This stuffing isn't as bad, but... I thought, <laughs> I thought that was stuffing! But it says fur! He needs brushed. Where's the brush? Uh, I think I, oh. I have three. I don't know where the other one was, so. I this... said the other one's somewhere on your bed. Uh, it's harder to brush when he doesn't have stuffing in him. He's ready for yeah. the restuffing. Yeah. That, nah, this, yeah. <laughs> yeah, look at this disgusting so now we have fresh stuffing hmm. uh, I think it might, might be talking about too much of this stuff right here stuffing him is really fun do you want to do that hmm. sound like a whole Bill and Bear thing <laughs> except there's a tiger yeah I think I can try to do it with one handed I'll hold the phone 
Wait, wait, hold the phone here. Do you want me to get his nose done first? So. Sure. Then uh, we can do his head. Yeah. This is about to be some serious stuff, people. <laughs> it's way more fun stuffing them than taking the stuffing out. Huh. This, is, this isn't actually my first time. I actually stuffed the hat, hat to my Stapo plush. Yeah. Feels a bit wet inside. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun, actually. Yeah, I think he. Do you think he has enough in his head? Uh, maybe. Uh, maybe a little more right here. That's a tiny piece. I need to find out where all the other stuffing is. There's just tiny pieces now. Okay. Uh, yeah, maybe we should take a break. Okay. We found a whole nother bag of stuffing for the update. Yeah. Uh, we're going to take a break for a sec. Don't worry, bud. We'll be back for you. We got his nose and his head stuffed. And, so far. and both of his legs. Oh, yeah. Bit. Yeah, he just needs some in his hips. And his arm. Yeah. I was afraid the beans would come out, but guess what? The beans are in, like, a separate little pouch, so they don't come out. Isn't that smart? Okay, so 
we took the old stuffing out, got the new stuffing in, sewed them back up, and now I'm just in the process of trying to brush him a little bit to try to soften his fur up a little bit. I wanted to make him still kind of squishy and floppy. I didn't want him to be stiff. Um, I think he's pretty good. I think I may have put a little too much stuffing in him. But I can always fluff him up like this. And what I learned is when you're putting the stuffing in before you like feel the whole leg up, for example... You put, have just stuffing right here before you fill this part up. You like kind of squish it around and fluff it up. Then you put more and do that again. Well, I figured that out with... I don't even remember where I figured that out with. But I kind of wanted the legs... Like I wanted them to not be stiff stiff. But I still wanted them to be stuffed enough. Especially right here because I wanted his head to be able to stay up like that. I didn't want his head to be flat on the ground or bed. Whatever you want to call it. Um, so, yeah, right now I'm just in the process of this. But um, it's actually the next morning. Slept with him last night. He's pretty comfortable. Um, again, no tag. So, I have... No idea what company he's from. So, if you guys know... <clears throat> so, if you guys know or you have him or are willing to help me figure it out, please let me know down in the comments below because I would love to know what company he's from. But he's super adorable. And I love him so much. Um, Tyler named him, but I can't remember what. <laughs> so, I don't know. I might name him myself or ask Tyler. Because I kind of liked the name that Tyler gave him. But yeah, <laughs> I know this kind of looks weird. I'm just trying to fluff him up. Um, Because I wanted him to be kind of floppy. But when I first got him, there was no stuffing at all right here. So that's why I opened them up and found out the stuffing was all dirty. So anyways, yeah, this is, I don't know the name yet, but love him so much. Um, I'll give you a quick overview of him just so you know if you're going to help me figure out what company he's by. This is his tail length. And his tail didn't have stuffing in it before, but I put stuffing in it. The paws are brown. If you can see. Dark brown. Um, he's pretty big. Um, actually, wait. So, you want to see how big he is? <clears throat> That's him compared to the Wild Republic Jumbo Wolf. About the same size. Maybe a little bit smaller. Yeah, a little bit smaller, but pretty much almost the same size. Um, so here's the face. I know my light's not on right now. Nose has stripes right here because I saw one on eBay. It kind of looked like him, but the tail was stuffed. Um, it had dots here, which this one might have faded. But it, the one on eBay didn't have the stripes right here on the, like, muzzle. And didn't have the yellowish brown fur there. So, yeah. This is him. I love him so much. But, yeah. So, if you guys want to help me figure out what company he's from, that would be more than appreciated. But I hope you guys enjoy this little makeover. I'm going to try to brush him out a little bit more. He's definitely getting softer right here. But the fur, of course, isn't fluffed up. But it's fine. Also, <clears throat> so if you know me, I collect plushies. So I don't play with them. I collect them. 
I take pictures of them and post them on Instagram. I make review videos of them on here. On my channel. And this is the Suthi's White Tiger. Well, I collect plushies. And especially my Feo Shorts and Saver Space ones, I don't want to ruin them by snuggling with them. I don't want to mess up their fur because when you snuggle with plushies, their fur isn't as soft anymore because of the oils on your skin. And also, when you snuggle with them, it like messes up the stuffing. So say I was to, some, to sn yeah. <laughs> say I was to snuggle with my Saver Space Wolf right there. If I snuggled with him, he would probably lose stuffing in his legs and in his body. And by loose stuffing, I don't know how it happens because they don't actually lose stuffing. They, like, the stuffing just disappears in a th thin air. It, like, it's not like it has a hole in it and stuffing's coming out of it. But there's just, like, stuffing loss in a certain part. So the only thing that could happen is when you snuggle with it, it pushes the stuffing that's right here into another part of him. And then there's less here and more here. That could be the only, my only conclusion for that. So, yeah. Anyways. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't know if I showed you. But since I bought this giant tiger, that was only a dollar, by the way. And three other plushies to sell on Mercury. The guy gave me this one for free. And he is from the Petting Zoo. So adorable. But his nose is like huge. That's the only flaw. And I don't know, this fur is kind of cheap, but wait. Let me brush it and maybe it'll look better. I'm going to brush him a little bit too, but yeah, he kind of reminds me of a Wild Republic. Don't have a Wild Republic tiger, so I might put him on the shelf with the other ones. Um, So when I got him, I was debating. Should I keep him? Should I sell him on Mercury? Or should I give him to my aunt that loves tigers? And I don't know yet. I mean... His nose kind of looks funny, but like, look how good they did on these stripes, especially the tail. I don't have a tiger plush that has stripes this good, so I don't know what to do because <clears throat> I know my aunt doesn't want clutter of plushies like me, and I'm planning on getting her special tiger plushies like the Feo Schwartz tiger and the Saver Space ones. Because those are the very, very, very good quality plushies. And I want to get her a good quality plushie. Not to say that this guy's cheap. I mean, in a way he is. But he's not like the cheapest made stuffed animal. But he's definitely not the nicest or non-cheapest. He's not the highest quality. That's what I'm trying to say. To me, the highest quality is Saver Space and Feo Schwartz and those types of plushies. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoy it and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Also, there's different ways to brush a plushie. So, there's this way. You put pressure on it and pull up. To try to fluff get that fur up because you usually brush like this and it kind of like pushes the fur down um this is like going against it so it's harder this is going for it so it's softer a softer brush <laughs> but bumpy for some reason and then there's this one where you just put pressure on it pull up and that tries to get the fur up Yes.